Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you might know, there was a trend going around on YouTube, I think like three years ago, of waking up at 5 a.m. for an entire week. And I actually already did this trend, I think like a year ago. But recently I've just been really needing to like romanticize my life a bit more. And I feel like waking up at 5 a.m. in the morning is the perfect way to do that. So that is going to be today's video, waking up at 5 a.m. for a whole week. Recently I would say my sleep schedule actually has not been that bad. Like I'll go to bed at around like 10 or 11 and then wake up at around like like seven or eight, which I feel like isn't too bad. But right now I'm going to make a Pinterest board as well as a to-do list of all the things I want to do for the next like five mornings. But without further ado, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. It was currently 5 or 6 a.m. Waking up this morning was actually not that difficult, but the first day is usually the easiest day to get up, so. But I think first things first this morning, I'm gonna go make a cup of tea, and then I have a different video that I need to start editing. pretty surprised about how energized I am. Like as I said, the first day is usually the easiest, but I feel like most days if I just naturally allow myself to wake up, it usually takes me a lot longer to actually wake up and get out of bed. a little bit of the editing that I was planning on doing today and right now I think I'm just gonna chill for a bit watch some Gilmore Girls go on my phone also I don't know if you can see but the sun's like kind of coming up but it's like overcast and misty so you can't really see the sunrise one thing I've also definitely noticed is I'm a lot calmer like usually first thing in the morning I immediately have this like wave of anxiety which is just like amazing but this morning i haven't really had anxiety yet i just woke up feeling calm and i haven't felt this calm in literal months so that's pretty nice So I finished getting ready, got dressed. This outfit is very much giving like Pinterest. I'm about to go sit in like a cute little coffee shop and read Twilight. Unfortunately, that is not the case. But I got this sweater yesterday. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I also got like a striped long sleeve, which you guys will either see tomorrow or later this week. But yeah, it's actually just the sweater from H&M. Jeans also from H&M. I just also have like a black tank top on underneath from Mr. Price. And then I literally have on like socks and slippers because I do not plan on going anywhere today. Like I'm literally just gonna stay home, edit and read. <laughs> so it's currently 7.58, it's almost eight o'clock. And probably for the last hour or so, I have just been sitting scrolling on my phone, which I should not be doing. Doing. But one thing I have definitely noticed about waking up this early is once I start doing like more lazy things like scrolling through my phone and stuff I tend to get tired really really quickly Like I'm not like tired to the point where I can go to sleep But I'm like sitting there yawning feeling really lazy Which if you think about it, it's actually not a bad thing because it's gonna make me go on my phone less But right now I think I'm going to go make breakfast Usually I would not eat breakfast this early in the morning But if you think about it, I've already been up for like what three hours So yeah, I'm gonna go make breakfast I think I'm just gonna make flapjacks because it's like cold and rainy and then we'll see what I do from there. So it's currently 9.32 and I finished eating, finished getting ready, brushed my teeth. Also, I ignore my hair. It's looking kind of funky today. But right now, I think I'm just going to start with some editing. And then for the rest of the day, it's probably going to be kind of chill since it's cold. So yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. Okay, good morning, guys. So it's currently 5.04. Today so far has been really, really hard to actually get up. I'm okay with being awake. It's the thought of like actually having to do something now. But I think right now I actually want to start reading my book. It's over there in the bookshelf and I've been needing to read it for like a week now. And let's be honest, I do not have the mental energy to do 
anything else. <laughs> starting to slowly get light outside and i don't know if you can tell but it's like kind of overcast so i won't probably be able to see the sunrise but i've been trying to go on walks every single day and last night i kind of got so that's why i want to go this morning and then i'll also go later today obviously let me just like take out my braids though because they look kind of ridiculous <laughs> my hair looks so curly now <laughs> giving twilight. Okay, so this is the OTD. It's like kind of cold and rainy outside, but it's also gonna get warmer later today. So I just put on this long sleeve, it's from H&M. These jeans are also from H&M. They're actually low-waisted, which I never wear low-waisted jeans. <laughs> My jewelry is from Novisa. And then once again, I'm just wearing slippers with socks. But as rainy and cold as it is outside right now, I think for breakfast, I'm actually gonna have a smoothie because I have not had one in like forever and I'm actually feeling like having one today. So I made my smoothie. It's really, really good. It's exactly what I was in the mood for. It's pretty annoying to me though when if I make like a really good smoothie, the next like 10 smoothies after that usually end up being absolutely disgusting. But today I am actually in a really, really good mood because yesterday did not go as planned. But then last night I ended up like kind of planning out a little bit more what I want to do today. And my morning has been going a lot better. So, but since yesterday did not go as planned, I also did not get a lot of editing done. So that is my plan for most of today is to just try and edit my video so yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow morning at 5 a.m So it's currently 5.42 and as you can probably tell today so far has been a fairly slow morning because I just woke up feeling really really motivated. I was like you know what today I'm just gonna take a chill day. I ended up finishing all of the editing that I needed to do yesterday. That means today I can just take a breather but as you guys saw I got up, did my skincare and then I made myself some white hot chocolate in my cute little Gilmore Girls mug and speaking of right now I'm gonna watch some Gilmore Girls, maybe catch up on some YouTube and just chill. I think the only plans I have today is a therapy session from 9 to 11 and I think that's it so today I'm just gonna take a little chill day Okay, so I'm dressed for the day. Sweater is from H&M, same with the jeans. Jewelry is from Levisa. And then as of right now, I am wearing slippers. But later when we have to leave, I'm just gonna put on my white gym shoes. Okay, but right now I quickly wanna go make myself some breakfast. I think I wanna make like a bagel with an egg or something. I'm not really sure yet, but, but yeah, I'm gonna make some breakfast and watch some Gilmore Girls while I'm busy. <laughs> My second to last day of waking up at 5 a.m. for a week. I'm so excited to just sleep in. <laughs> but it's already 5.23. I literally got up, cleaned dog pee, made myself some hot chocolate, and it's already like 20 minutes into the day. Like what? But this morning was like kind of difficult to get out of bed. It's like my bed was really comfortable. It's also like cold and windy outside. And I was really, really tempted to go back to sleep. <laughs> but I was like, you know what? It's my second to last day. Let me just finish this week. Technically, I'm also waking up at 5 a.m. on Saturday, but that's for something different. <laughs> okay, but the first thing I want to start doing this morning is some editing because my plan was to just do like a bunch of editing this weekend, but plans ended up changing and we are going away for the weekend. We are going to the Cruise National Park and I cannot really edit while well we're there, so I really want to try and do some of it now. And for anyone wondering, yes, I do plan on vlogging at the Cruise Park. <laughs> Oh my goodness. 
Okay, next I want to do like a quick at-home workout because I kind of want to attempt to like kind of wake myself up But I also don't want to do something that's too tiring because today has definitely so far been like the worst day Because like I'm not tired enough to go to bed, but I'm like still kind of drowsy And then I'm also incredibly unmotivated and not in the mood to film at all But I literally have this lazy little full body workout that's like seven minutes and I've done it before and it's really nice because you still get to move your body But it's just not nearly as tiring also I completely I completely forgot to mention this, but we literally hit 700 subscribers last night. You guys are so amazing. I love you guys so much. As you guys saw, I finished working out, got in the shower, I washed my hair. I also literally just got back into my PJs because this is gonna sound really bad after taking a chill day yesterday, but I think today I'm gonna take another chill day because yesterday was like low key a waste of a day. Like I was in a good mood, I was motivated, I wasn't feeling tired. So I could have easily gotten so much editing done, but I still decided to sit on my phone for like most of the day which led me to feeling absolutely horrible this morning literally in the shower i was thinking like okay i have so much work to catch up on and blah 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 and then i was like what do you mean work to catch up on technically i am on a break i do not have an upload schedule right now i do not have a filming schedule i will do these things on my own time but yeah and the whole point of my break is to not push myself when i feel absolutely horrendous because that is actually what led me to feeling as burnt out as i do right now so yeah today i'm going to take a chill day i do however have to finish making a thumbnail but that's not too bad but yeah i just want to thank you guys again for your patience i know i've been pretty inconsistent so far this year i found it so funny because i literally said like 2024 is going to be my year at some point i will kind of talk about like what's been going on it's just right now i'm still kind of in the middle of things so i don't really even know how to explain what's going on okay but that is day four of waking up at 5 a.m complete i will see you guys guys tomorrow morning. Okay, good morning guys. And today is actually my last day of waking up at 5 a.m. per week. I might still be waking up at 5 a.m. tomorrow for something else, but anyway. Weirdly enough, today is actually like a difficult day for me to get out of bed. I feel like usually the last day is one of the easiest, but I'm like really cold. My feet are cold. My bed's really comfy. And I really just want to sleep, but I'm not going to, <laughs> but I'm not going to. Okay, first things first, I'm going to get up and go make myself a cup of tea. Okay, so I finished getting ready, got dressed. I'm literally wearing the exact same outfit I wore on Tuesday. <laughs> also, sorry my voice sounds kind of weird, my nose is like blocked. But the plans for the rest of the day, first of all, my mom and I are gonna go to the grocery shop a little bit later. Then I need to pack for the Kruger, I need to do some editing. And then obviously we're gonna go to the Kruger, which is gonna be a different vlog. But that is bringing us to the end of today's video. Okay, so we're gonna ignore the fact that I look like I haven't showered in the week. I swear that's not the case, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> but I was editing this video and I realized I never filmed an outro. So here we are. Basically, as I told you guys, I actually filmed this video probably like a year ago and that video is still public on my channel. And this time filming it was so much different compared to that time. Like I felt this time there was so many positive I feel under pressure because my camera battery is flashing right now, so it's like speak Maya. There were so many more benefits this time. Like my anxiety was significantly better. I don't know what that actually has to do with waking up at 5 a.m. though because a bunch of stuff also did happen this week that contributed to not being anxious anymore. So I don't really know. My sleep schedule was getting a lot better. I was feeling a lot more motivated this week and I would highly recommend doing this even if it's just for a day. I would just highly recommend getting enough sleep but that is going to be the end of today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you stayed all the way to the end comment the coffee emoji in honor of Gilmore Girls and I'll see you guys in my next video.